Hi guys, Stuart from Solitech. Just uh, wanting to show you a little bit of uh, SolarWorks and capturing your settings of your SolarWorks session. Um, decided that I think I'd like to make some changes to my setup. So before I do, I want to make sure that the current settings are captured. So I'm going to go down to my um, programs and go to all programs and find my SolarWorks installation folder. And under there, there is a SolarWorks tools folder going to go into the SOLIDWORKS tools and there's an option that says copy settings wizard. Now this opens up this little dialog that you can see at which point we can capture settings to a file. So I want to save my settings so I'm just going to go next. Now because I've got SOLIDWORKS already running it brings up a little dialog box as you can see and <coughs> I don't want to uh, close down my SOLIDWORKS session so I do want to continue so I'm going to go next and it says okay well where do you want to save these two? So I'm just going to browse and say I'll want to just save those um, on my C drive and go OK and it's just going to save this settings file and the settings is a basically a registry backup from from the SOLIDWORKS in your registry settings and I want to capture my keyboard short up, shortcuts, my menu customization, system options and if you like toolbars the whole lot so as soon as I go finish it writes all of that information to a file. Now if we change some settings so I've decided I want to customize um, some of my screen so I'm just going to go customize and in my commands I can add and remove commands to my toolbars and I think to myself oh actually I'd like to have some web commands uh, visible even on my heads up display so I'll just customize that and go yep that's what I wanted to do so I'm kind of finished with that so we can uh, <coughs> then close that one down so I've got that setting on there so I've got my web setting and then I decided, oh, actually, no, I don't want that. I'd like to get back to where I was. So if we go back to our start and we go back to our programs, find our SOLIDWORKS installation folder, go to the tools and go to copy settings, we can restore some settings. I'm just going to go next. Where do I want to get them from? From the settings file. I want to restore all of those things. We'll go next. <coughs> For the current user, just go next. And yes, there's a session already running. So um, I'm going to close it and retry. So as you can see, I can't do it with it running. So I'll just go, OK, well, let's cancel that for a second. Um, yep, I want to cancel. So I'm going to shut down my SOLIDWORKS session. And I'm going to go back to that tool, <coughs> into my programs, SOLIDWORKS. And we'll fire up our copy settings wizard. And I want to restore some settings from that file. Next, for this computer. And we'll go, yep, yeah, that's what I'm, I don't need a backup of the ones I've got. Let's just go finish. Yes. So it copies that through. And now when we go back to my um, SOLIDWORKS session, you can see that when, you set, when it fires that up, we've got our settings back the way they were. <coughs> just open up a recent, recent file. Let's not let me have that. Just go to a recent document that I had open. And as soon as we get our heads up display, there's no web settings. So as you can see, that's how you can save your settings and also restore your settings.